Materials required are wax block, measuring scale, divider, lacron cover with sharp and blunt end. First, we'll smoothen the wax block to get an even surface. And label buccal aspect, palatal or the lingual aspect, mesial aspect, distal aspect, Now we will start drawing the midline on all the four aspects. Start marking the crown and the root length. Crown length 7.5 mm, root length 14 mm. Mesiodistal diameter of the crown is 11 mm. Mesiodistal diameter of the crown at the cervix is 9 mm. Now let's draw the line and remove the extra wax. Buccolingual diameter of the crown is 10.5 mm. Buccolingual diameter of the crown at cervix is 9 mm. Now, let's draw the line and remove the extra wax. The mesiodistal diameter is more than the buccolingual diameter. Now, remove the extra wax to get a trapezoid shape. Let's start carving the occlusal aspect. We have to carve 5 cusps. Mesiobuccal, distobuccal, mesiolingual, distolingual and the distal. Mesiobuccal is larger than the mesiolingual and the distolingual. Distobuccal is smaller. Distal is the smallest of all. First, we will carve the mesiobuccal, distobuccal, distal cusp, and then the two lingual cusp. Mesiobuccal, distobuccal cusps are relatively flat, while the distal cusp is pointed, and other two palatal cusps are also pointed. Let's carve the central developmental groove and the mesial and distal triangular fossa. Buccal cusps are shorter than the lingual cusps. As we are done with the occlusal aspect, we are done with the carving of the crown. Now let's start with the root carving. Mark the outline of the roots, turn the carving towards the buccal aspect and draw the buccal outline of the roots. This is how it looks from the buccal aspect.
Draw outline for bifurcation from the buccal and the lingual aspects. Make a hole from buccal to palatal side to form two roots. From buccal aspect, point of bifurcation is 3 mm below the cervical line. From lingual aspect, point of bifurcation lies 4 mm below the cervical line. Draw the outline of the mesial and the distal root and start removing the wax from the buccal and the palatal sides. Let's make developmental depression over the distal and the mesial root. Developmental depression is quite deep at this point. Let's draw the cervical outline which is 1 mm below in the mesial side. Now let's polish the tooth. 